Hello everyone, Al Supreme here, coming 101, going to do another review. Um, this is why I said this is kind of tricky when you go on eBay or when you go online to buy a turtle toy. Because you never know when it's, something looks like this. Because it looks like 1988. And they will put 1988 because this looks like the original foot soldier. Now, the thing is, there's like three different um, cards. This is, like looks like series one. Series two is when all three or all four of them together, and Raphael has his hands out, and he looks like he's handing out a toy to you. Series three is just like they're in the sewers and they're crawling all over the place with turtles. But since this is, looks like 1988, it's gonna be tricky because, like I said, if they doesn't show the back, gotta be careful because the back is different. So uh, yeah, gotta keep your eyes open for that. Especially if you're a fan out there, um, the 1988 Turtle R Fist Soldier is actually could be like around 40 bucks. That little list right here. Like this one, this is a 1990, and it's a little bit cheaper from what I found. But I'm pretty sure it's expensive too, because you don't know, see a 1990 Fist Soldier anywhere, but size 88, which is kind of cool. But the second series box is going to be a little bit more expensive. But the third series is going to be like, well, how do I put it? The third series is going to be a little bit difficult because it's going to be a little more expensive because the last time I saw a third series with a coin card and a gold coin together, it was up to like $150 just for that. And that one, let's see, that one came out in 1994. But there's also another third series that didn't come with, doesn't come with anything. And of course, that's going to be a little bit cheaper, like maybe like 40 bucks or $50 compared to that other one. But hopefully you guys can find a dealer out there who sells Turtles toys for cheap. And if you want to know who that I found, I found a couple of them out there, but the one I found that is actually pretty good, decent, and cheap. Alright, these people. Fighter Corners, original store, uh, they're inside the swap meet. And then you get the second one, uh, this thing is going up. Second store, it's right here. They just opened it up, and here's her Facebook right here and the phone number. Now, like this, as you can see, it's not been punched or unpunched, I say. And you can see the, the foot soldier and attacks. And he's attacking the L, as you can see, with his weapon. And you see the background, it has like the yellow background, so the orange. And his weapons, as you can see, what kind of weapons he carries and comes with. Um, also, if you can't tell, the foot soldiers, the original ones, are like a little waxy, kind of like a fade kind of color. But this one doesn't have that wax look to it. I like these foot soldiers better, no matter what. These are my always my favorite ones, and I'm making an army out of my foot soldiers. I will put the other foot soldier reviews underneath it so you can see my well I think I have like six foot soldiers already. As you can see there's no heroes in the half shell on top of them. Foot soldier. And I'm touching it with the main weapon. And that's the original symbol right there. And here he is on the side. Looks like alien kinda like. Okay now to the back part. As you see, it doesn't have like, you know, this turtle, April, and Splinter, and Shredder, or B-Bomb, or saying Foot Soldiers, that's it. This one has everything in the background, so this is why you be careful what card you have, because these backgrounds are different. As you can see, the wacky turtles, and the good guys are right here. Of course, Casey Jones with his yellow baseball bat. Of course, the bad guy is over here. And we'll slash with his purple belt. And then the, the weapons, and it tells you which weapons are what and what the names. In case Rock say Blade is dull. As you can see, like that. But, we have a little bit of an issue here. See the blade? See how it sticks out and everything? See the handlebars? Yeah, that's a foot soldier blade. Check this out. That's a rock steady blade. Not a foot soldier. See the difference? See how it only has one bar going down? The blade and the handlebar is just a handlebar. But then you got this. The blade was sticks out and it's not straight down square. 
and the handlebar is a little bit different. So yes, people, there is a blooper on this. Of course, you got that. Of course, you got that. Of course, I always miss the portrait of the foot soldier to tell you everything about them. Look at if you're curious, where is it? Where did I put it? Birthplace. This is where the foot soldiers are made in. Now you know. And of course, uh, 1990 does it prove to you that this is a, a fake? It's not fake at all. I heard a safe one piece of point. Yeah, so once again, foot soldier weapon. See the difference? And you got rock steady blade right here. And it's attached to it, to the thing right here as you can see so yeah just some little mix up here and it's real it's not like you know like oh this is made in like some foreign country with you know bloopers this is a real deal and they did screw up the weapons so I have a blooper here that's a foot soldier so yeah all right people I know this is a short review and everything but seriously when you buy your turtle toys Pay attention, make sure it's actually the original because people will say it was original, we'll price it up and not even think about the background. Um, there's a lot, I have another blooper coming up and that's from Michelangelo from 1988, but it's the 25th anniversary. You, you'll get a kick out of it. But like I said, check your foot soldier weapons because they are out there with the wrong blade. I don't know if Playmates knows this or not, but it is attached to the, to the actual um, thing that holds the weapons together. So, uh, put your comments down, tell me what you guys think about it. Did you guys know about this, that it's made from a different year besides 1988? I mean, just tell me what you think about this also. So, yeah, I just see your collection, people, no matter what. And the thing is also, I can't prove if maybe he's printed 1990 in the back of his back, or maybe it actually says 1990 in the back. If you have one... Check the back of your foot soldiers and check out what year it is. If you have one that actually says in a different year besides 88, tell me so I can actually know. Because there's no way I'm going to open this up. No way. So, until uh, next time, people, take care of yourself and happy hunting.